Choco's blind date. The young freshly baked are such loafs. Is the hot and steamy life more appealing than a happy marriage? Oh, it's a mystery. They might enjoy being single, but they'll regret it later. You got that right. And you, huh? what's your excuse? At your age, you should have a husband and children. I won! Ah. Choco, ah. what exactly did you win? I won the lottery for a show for Cat Cakes, the hottest new musical on Broadway. Wow, that sounds fun. Who are you going to go with? Alone, obviously. Alone, oh. obviously? Choco, Ooh. this is exactly the problem. You're too old not to be married. Here, go meet this uh -huh. guy. His name is Bagel. He's my neighbor's son. He graduated at the top of his class at NYB, summa cum laude. He's a member of Matza. They only accept geniuses. Bagel's the youngest CEO ever at Johnny Cake and Johnny Cake. He probably makes at least a million dollars a year. Wow. That's a lot of dough. Oh, that's nothing. He has the perfect body. No fat, all carbs. Virtuoso, painter, master chef. Chaco, I'm going to introduce you to him myself. I'd marry him. You gotta meet him. Well, that's nice. <laughs> How do you want to pay? I'm out of here. Huh? Cacao, I presume? Who, who are you? Mrs. Donut didn't tell me you looked this delicious. Uh. My name is... <gasps> oh, no. Correct. I'm the exec everyone's talking about. Perfection incarnate, it's me, Bagel. <sighs> <sighs> What's wrong with him? Psycho. Back so soon, huh? Chaco? Won't you join us for overtime? I heard the reviews for cat cakes weren't that good anyway. Stay late with us. This is your home now. Oh. Wow, I like this even less. <gasps> Bagel, let's get out of here. Okay. How do you like riding with me in a convertible? <laughs> uh, it's all right. The seats are fine calf leather. The speakers, limited edition. Music muffin? Oh, huh? oh. Mm. I know that sound. My cacao. She must be hungry. I have huh? leftovers in the fridge. Oh, no, muffin. I'm taking you to a five star establishment. <laughs> wow, this place is amazing. Glad you noticed. It takes more than a month to make a reservation. <laughs> yes. The prefix is a thousand dollars. No, no. Everything I order is not on the menu. I'll take care of everything. They know me here. Wait, what? Stefan? I'll have my usual. Sir. Wh what is this? Yes, uh -huh. yes. Cooked to perfection. So good, right? You can taste the difference when it's organic. Uh, yeah, it's good, I guess, but when is the main course going to come? Like steak? No, <gasps> no! Are you insane? Don't you know that eating meat is what makes pastries go bad? Besides, grilled meat is chock full of deadly chemicals. Eating meat really is taking your life in your own hands. Meat-filled pastries are really pathetic. Why are you saying that in a restaurant? What a nut job. I'm sorry. I can't eat this now. He must think he's so smart. What a complete psycho. Never again. <sighs> what is it now? Who is it? Hello, Muffin. <gasps> I'm in front of your house. Good morning. What? Why did you come to my house? We have to get our exercise in. Come on, let's go. <laughs> Where are you taking me? Running boosts your metabolism, and it's the best way to keep fresh. <sighs> I already feel 10 days expired. If you continue loafing around like this, by my count, you'll expire in 27 days. 27 days? If you days? want to stay fresh longer, start running! <sighs> Lots of liquids are necessary after jogging. Are you guys ready to order? Uh, iced Americano with extra ice, please. No! Huh? What is it now? Caffeine, the main ingredient in coffee, stops you from getting your daily dose of vitamin D and iron. Two glasses uh, of fresh squeezed cabbage juice. Uh, mm. Sure. Bagel! I want my coffee. You can't just order for you. Cacao! You're the first muffin I've ever ordered cabbage juice for. In the past, I've ordered onion juice, ginger juice, and arrowroot juice. I saved the fresh squeezed cabbage juice just for you, my muffin. If you drink this, you won't ever need to drink an iced mochaccino or whatever again. Cheers. <laughs> Cacao, I brought you some cabbage juice. Please leave me alone. 
Muffin, you know how fast a sports car is. No, and I don't care. What? No! <gasps> Choco, why are you sleeping during office hours? <gasps> hmm? Oh, it's only a dream. Hmm? <sighs> hey, Muffin, bet you've never been with a bagel who's got this much protein. My transcript from NYB, straight A's every semester. Check out my office. Pretty swanky, right? When I was young. What a prank! <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> All right, Michael. Who do you think you are? Stop texting me when I'm at work, period. Don't call me again. Oh. Huh? I was so wrong. Give me one more chance. I'm begging oh. you. How did he get here? I've got uh, something special for you, Muffin. Uh, Front row seats for Breadway's Phantom of the Office. Do you like musicals? I'm uh, never going uh, now! Huh? What? But these tickets were impossible to get. I know how much you like Breadway. Please, please give me one last chance. Why is there nobody here? Oh, you'll see. It's just about to start. <sighs> Another hard day at work. All I want is to enjoy my life as a hot young single muffin. This singles cruise I've saved up for will be so much fun. You sure this is Phantom of the Office? Ooh. Keep mm. watching. Muffin, oh. where are you off to? Oh, bagel. You eat alone, watch films alone, and go on vacation alone. How can you be happy living like this? You don't ever need to be alone again. You'll have me. I'm rich and handsome and yours. Make me the happiest bagel in Bakery Town. Oh, bagel. I've loved you since the moment we met. Oh, Choco. Oh, bagel. Oh. Bravo, bravo. Cacao, what do you say? Are you ready for our future together? I've loved you since the moment we met. Make me the happiest. Oh, uh, uh. That's the last straw. Who does this crepe think he is? <sighs> Cacao, please. Cacao, wait. It's Choco, not Cacao. Choco. Cacao, stay. Are you afraid because you think I'm just too good for you? No way. I'm going to eat meat, never exercise, and drink coffee every single day. Oh, no. <laughs> Don't give up on life just yet. I'm not uh, giving up. Uh, Why do you think you're better than everyone else? Uh, uh, hey, Choco, uh, what you doing? Huh? Wilk, what are you wearing? Ah, Bagel, uh, I'm sorry. I uh, really uh, should have told you earlier. Uh, I'm actually with uh, Wilk here. I hope what? that you'll finally leave me alone now. Huh? You think he's husband material? Cacao, why? Have you gone stale? A refined lady like you must be with a rich, handsome, intelligent specimen like me to live a life of... Oh! <sighs> finally, it's over. I took care of him. Uh, I'm sorry, Choco. Uh, uh, I never knew you thought of uh, me that way. It must have been uh, so hard for you. Uh, oh, uh, no, Wilk, it's not like that. I was just... Shh. I, too, feel the same way. But I'm in a committed relationship with work right now. Maybe when I grow up to be a great barber someday. <gasps> <gasps> that creepy bagel and that Wilk? Why is everyone doing this to me today? Uh, Cursed mirror. Hey! What? Another one? This is the third mirror you've broken. Oh, what a great job. I'm a mm. jinx. We need to replace that mirror fast. We're opening soon. Uh, go buy us a new one. Uh, okay. I'll hurry back. Don't uh, drop it on the way back. Uh, hmm. Any mirror shops around? Huh? I sent you looking to buy a mirror. Uh, well, mister, how did you know? Follow. I will show you a special one. Hmm. Oh, wow! <laughs> you have so many mirrors. This mirror is Rococo. This one is modern. And this one is avant-garde. Which one of these should I get? Um, huh? This is the mirror you should purchase. Oh, that's kind of old. Listen, you! This mirror was used by only the greatest barbers throughout history. 
During the Renaissance, the royal barber twisted veal or used it to groom kings and dukes. Only those of royal filling could be beautified in front of this mirror. Because of twisted veal, it's beyond priceless. But I'll sell it to you at a special discount of $100. What? $100? That's the exact amount of cash Master Bread gave me. You and this mirror must be destined for each other. Take it now. It's a bargain. Thank you, sir. Thanks a bunch. Thanks again, mister. Don't break it. <laughs> I'm free! You bought this ugly piece of junk for a hundred dollars? Yep. It's a special mirror used by lots of famous barbers throughout history. You got scammed! Huh? Who sold this trash to you? I want my money back! Wilk is actually right. Uh. Says here it was a luxury mirror used by royal barbers in the Renaissance. An Italian carpenter crafted it from special oak trees that only grow on cliffs. At auction, it starts at one million dollars. A million? Should I throw it out? Are you insane? Oh. It's an antique! Uh. Have some respect. I've loved you since I first laid eyes on you. Mm. Oh, if I was a mirror, I'd marry you. Mm. Hmm. There, your hair's what? all done. Wow, my hair styled by the famous bread. It must look uh, uh, I'm hideous. Hello? Uh, How could uh, this happen? I'm the best barber in bakery town can't make me pretty, and it's just impossible. I'll never be beautiful. I don't deserve what? to be happy. Uh, wait. What's going on, Mr. Bread? <gasps> Why do I have wrinkles? I look a hundred days past my sell-by date. Wilk, what's the deal? <gasps> What the? I look older than my grand muffin. What's going on? <laughs> I look more curdled than cottage uh, cheese. Hmm. Uh, I'm still handsome, though. Mm -hmm. Mr. Bread looks the same. Maybe it's because he's already ugly. What's the deal with this mirror, anyway? The customer's reflections look weird. Maybe it's cursed or something. Huh? Oh, yeah. It's 100% cursed. <laughs> we should call an exorcist. Uh, oh, why did this one have to be cursed? <laughs> <laughs> I'm out of here. Bye. Spirits, I call upon you. Ma'am, are you able to drive out the demons possessing my mirror? Fear not. It'll be a piece of pie. Uh. <laughs> uh. <laughs> what did you see? Are you all right? That, uh. that thing is cursed. A specter with a twisted body possesses the mirror. <laughs> a specter with a twisted body? <laughs> uh, 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 I polished those today. Uh, 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 what's happening? Your bread, I'm so scared. Uh, 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 what the hell is that? Is mine. Hands up! Uh, hey, what? Uh, uh, I'm too young to. Oh. Huh? Wait, uh -huh. I'm okay. Nothing happened. Uh, wow, I got chills when the ghost's arm went through me. Yeah, you're right. Oh. You do get chills. I kind of like it. Uh, oh. Creepy, but awesome. Uh -huh. Even in a death, I'm a doom to be ignored. Uh -huh. Wow, ghosts can cry too. <laughs> Here, I made you tea. Grazie. <gasps> oh, oh, that oh. teacup was my mother's. I'm so sorry. Why am I so tragic even in the afterlife? What happened that was so tragic you became a ghost stuck in a mirror? I was a royal <gasps> hairdresser in Italia. Oh, are you the famous barber Twisted Fellow? See, si. I began the cutting the hair after I came out of the oven. Throughout my career, I was a barber to all the royal families in Europe. But I was so busy, I was never able to get my own haircut. I always saw how magnifico I made my own patrons, and how unmagnifico I looked in the mirror every day. That's why I became bound to the mirror. <laughs> that makes me sad. All you wanted was to look magnifico. This is our fate as barbers. If I get a nice trim, maybe I'll be able to leave this mirror once and for all. Signore um, Pane, uh, would you a cut to my hair? Uh, 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 Mr. Bread, you uh, gotta give him uh, a trim so he can move on, uh, please. If I help this dead Italian guy out, I'll get the mirror. All right, I'll do it. But when I'm done, in return, I get the mirror. Deal? <laughs> Deal. Grazie, <laughs> grazie. That's so great, Twisted Velo. Right, let's start with cream. Uh, uh, oh. 
I'll never look a magnifico. Don't cry, T. At least there's no hair for you to wash. I'll never get a haircut in my life. Don't huh? talk like that. Besides, you've already died. <laughs> Aha! What are you doing, Master Bread? Well, what do you think? Huh? Wow! Pretty great, don't you think? I love it. I look a magnifico. Grazie. I'm happy that you're happy. <laughs> that was so nice of you to help him out. Can I clean the paint off the mirror now? Paint? Uh, it's not real. Well, why did you have to open your big mouth? Oh, Twisted fellow must be so upset. Sorry, Mr. Bread. Even if he's dead, what kind of customer service is that? You're right. What if we painted more hair? Painted That's more so hair? Right. Oh? It's the first time anyone has really cared about me like this. That's better than any haircut you could have given. Grazie. When I look at you both, it finally makes me feel a magnifico. You are a true barber's. The mirror is yours now. Oh, oh. fellow, goodbye! Be at peace now, my friend! Phew, what a crazy day. <laughs> now the million dollar mirror is finally mine! Huh? Wilk, why is the mirror disappearing? <laughs> oh, the soul escaped and the curse is finally uh, been lifted! Uh, oh no! <laughs>